Since it took off in 2021, the James Webb Space Telescope has been a huge deal, a real step forward in trying to figure out the universe. This awesome telescope, packed with the latest tech, has turned into a key thing for space science, as it slowly shows us the secrets of the cosmos and changes how we see things. From the start, the James Webb has been super important in giving us amazing peeks into all sorts of astrophysics stuff, like where the universe came from, how galaxies form, and looking for alien life. Its cool gear and fancy pictures have let scientists peek deeper into space than ever, getting awesome pictures and info that make us think about old ideas and grow our space smarts. Speaking of its winds, the James Webb Telescope made a discovery not long ago that's got everyone in the science world buzzing. It might change how we get the basic setup of the universe. Check this out. The James Webb has taken a gorgeous picture of the edge of the universe, giving us a look into the unknown stuff out there. This big deal has started a ton of interest in talks, raising big questions about what's real and where we fit in the universe. What did NASA's newest telescope find? And how does it change the way we look at astronomy? The answers to these big questions are on the line of science stuff and waiting to come out as people keep researching the mysteries of space. When it comes to spotting exoplanets, the James Webb Telescope has been key in getting us closer to an old dream, knowing there are other worlds out there. Before, finding exoplanets was based on seeing little hints, like stars getting a bit dimmer. But Webb's super strength has let astronomers get the first direct pictures of planets outside our system. Back in September 2021, Webb had a major moment by taking a picture of HIPS 65426b, a huge gas planet way out in space. This cool success was a turning point in looking for exoplanets, giving scientists a look at all the different planets in our galaxy. HIP 65426b, super big and far from its star, is just one of many alien worlds waiting to be found and checked out. As people look at the tons of data from this telescope, they expect to understand the tricky stuff that controls how planets are born and changed. Besides exoplanets, the James Webb Telescope has changed how we understand faraway galaxies and what makes them tick. With its amazing pictures, Webb has given scientists rare looks at galaxy groups, old stars, and the big web of stuff out there called the Cosmic Web. One of the most mind-blowing things it found is SMAC 0723, a pack of galaxy clusters that act like zoom lenses, making the light from even farther stuff brighter. This thing, called gravitational lensing, has let astronomers see really old galaxies that were hidden before, bringing some light to the early days of the universe. Plus, the telescope has given us precious info about how planetary nebulas are made and change, like the Southern Ring Nebula. By checking out the light these space things give off, scientists have learned the tricky steps in star life cycles and system building. The Southern Ring Nebula, super far from Earth, has always wowed astronomers with its small details and shiny glow. Thanks to Webb's looks, researchers have shown things about how it was made that no one knew before, like how multiple stars play a big part in making its cool shape. One especially interesting thing from Webb messing around with the Southern Ring Nebula is finding a third star in the middle of it, which goes against old ideas about how it was made. This out of the blue thing has made people interested in nebulas again and the part they play in space. Basically, the James Webb Telescope is a sign of how smart people are and how much we want to know. All of its finds are growing what we know and pushing new explorers to go for the stars. As this science thing keeps moving, led by the strong gear on Webb, we expect to see awesome discoveries. One of these space wonders that the James Webb Telescope has been looking at is Stefan's Quintet, a small group of galaxies super far away in the Pegasus constellation. This interesting group has five galaxies. Four of them are mixed up in a space dance of constant close hangouts. How gravity works inside this group gives scientists a great chance to see how galaxies hanging out together changes how they change. Another area is the Carina Nebula, which is a place where stars are born. Webb's amazing picture skills have opened up hidden spots inside the nebula, showing the little details of star making. Its power to get through space just lets astronomers check out these space steps more clearly than before, growing our space understanding. Among Webb's most interesting looks is an odd exoplanet known as VHS 1256b. It's a brown dwarf, too big to be a planet but not big enough to be a star. 
Webb found a faint reddish glow around this thing, made by a rare kind of nuclear thing different from regular hydrogen. Super coolly, silica clouds were found in its air. This is the first time this has happened for something like this. This crazy thing gives researchers a rare look into how air acts between planet and star things. Webb looked at VHS 1256B's air layers and found stuff like water vapor, methane, carbon dioxide, and potassium, saying that there's a wild mix where lower layers with carbon dioxide mix with methane higher up. This tricky chemical dance adds more interest to this brown dwarf, making it a very cool thing for science. Another neat thing is the phantom galaxy, almost unseen by the naked eye. It shines well in the infrared light through Webb's lens. By mixing data from both Hubble and Webb, scientists made a shiny picture showing its spiral arms and dust things from its shiny center. This picture is part of a bigger group project called PGS, which uses Webb's dust-seeing power to show star making across a bunch of close galaxies. Just this February, the James Webb Telescope made another big find, answering one of the greatest questions, what's at the edge of the universe? By seeing six big galaxies super early after the Big Bang, Webb's find went against old beliefs. These galaxies, pretty old for their age, were different from old thoughts that said only little, young galaxies were there back then. This awesome thing has made astronomers think again about old models of galaxy growth, changing how we look at how the universe has grown. Finally, the James Webb Space Telescope keeps growing the borders of space smarts, shaking up science stuff and making people curious. From dancing galaxies to weird things like VHS 1256b, every look gives a peek into how complex the cosmos is. As Webb keeps its job, expect more big finds to light the way for astronomy's future. At first, some experts read the early data wrong. But later checks showed that the galaxies Webb saw were real and way more than expected. To figure out how these galaxies grew so fast, researchers want to use spectroscopy, a way that breaks light into its pieces to see what's there and find out how far away things are for sure. This data will give a clearer idea of how big and how changed the galaxy is. Leah said that we need to keep an open mind, considering that these looks are the farthest humans have seen into space's past. While the finds say these things are galaxies, there's still a chance some might be hidden super big black holes. On March 14, 2023, Stephanie Milam, the Associate Project Scientist for Planetary Studies on the James Webb Telescope, talked at the South by Southwest Conference in Austin, Texas. Milam shared how excited she was about Webb's incredible talents and praised the science group for their careful looks and research. She said that even more amazing things are coming, including info about planet starts and the mysterious dark matter. The telescope's power to follow galaxy changes over time should give important info on how dark matter acts and makes galaxies. Webb has also already used transit spectroscopy on exoplanets, letting scientists check air stuff by seeing starlight that goes through them. With a ton of exoplanets found so far, from big gas worlds to small rocky ones, there's so much to see. Among them is Saturn's moon, Titan, a cold world where methane and ethane rain, and the ground is made of icy rock. Not long ago, Webb got air readings from Titan and saw two cloud things. Scientists seeing Titan with Webb were stoked. Astronomer Sebastian Rodriguez from the University of Paris said, At first sight, it's crazy. I think we're seeing a cloud. The look of these clouds, especially over Kraken Mare, Titan's biggest sea, opens new questions about the moon's air. More checking is in flow to chart Titan's hazy layers and dig deeper into this alien place. It's truly surprising how new space bodies can be compared to Earth. A big moment happened when NASA took off the Webb telescope on Christmas Day in 2021. After so much prep by NASA folks, both takeoff and putting it out there went well. Since then, Webb has given awesome photos, giving clearer views of the universe. Thanks to its infrared sensors, it now shows galaxies so far that they were once hidden, giving shots of an old past that we couldn't see before. This tech win is changing our space view. Just days after going online in June 2022, Webb found a bunch of far galaxies, some older than anything we'd seen before by over 150 million years. This trove of data is showing the nature of planets, showing hidden steps, and changing space smarts. 
Not long ago, Webb looked at two merging galaxies called a 623. The result was awesome. Even though it's super far away, Webb's infrared powers got through thick dust to show something Hubble couldn't see, a zone of crazy star making with stars forming way faster than in our Milky Way. The picture, beautiful and small, looks like a great work made by the cosmos itself. Webb also found a layer beyond the dust that no one knew about before. This part is making strong infrared light and web star thing. This wild find, published in Astrophysical Journal, has made researchers excited. This galaxy mix might also be making something hidden, a super big black hole. This space show is one of a kind, and only Webb lets us see such a big thing. With its cool picture and data skills that can help look for alien life, the Webb Telescope is a big step in space science. Its future is good, with super chances for new stuff as we keep exploring the universe's mysteries. Since it started, the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has given some cool info into the early parts of planet making. One of its best things is its power to see protoplanetary disks, the stuff spinning around new starts that planets grow out of. Webb's infrared views have let astronomers check out these things more clearly than before, giving new ideas into how planets, moons, and other space bodies are made. 